welcome everyone this is dr abrafia here again back with the remaining coverage of the chapter dental vexes if you have not watched the previous video of this chapter watch it then come back here i have shared the link in the description i have made this video in the slide pattern because dental vexes are important to learn in diagrammatically manner and with visualization so let's start Today in this video we will learn types of different vexes, composition of vexes, uses of different vexes, color of different vexes and availability of vexes. Now the classification of vexes. We have pattern vexes, impression vexes and processing vexes. In pattern vexes we have three vexes that are base plate or modeling vex, inlay vex and casting vex. In impression vexes we have two vexes that are corrective vex and bite plate vex. In processing vex we have three vexes that are boxing vex, utility vex and the sticky vex. Now the base plate or modeling wax, it is a type of pattern wax that is available in pink color sheets. Its uses are, it is used for making wax pattern of complete and partial denture. It is used for wax pattern of orthodontic appliances. It is used for making occlusal rims for recording maxillary mandibular jaw relation. And its composition are as follows. It consists of pattern wax 70 to 80 percent. It consists of bees wax 12 percent, carnauba wax 3.5 percent, resins 3 percent, and synthetic wax 2.5 percent. Now, the base plate wax has the melting point in the range of 49 to 58 degrees centigrade. It has three types type 1, type 2, and type 3. The type 1 is soft wax, type 2 is hard wax, and type 3 is extra hard wax. Type 1 soft wax is used for making contour and veneering. Type 2 hard wax is suitable for pattern production in temperate climate. Type 3 extra hard wax it is stable at mouth temperature. This is how base plate wax looks like and is available in pink sheets. One important thing about inlay wax which is asked frequently in Viva that is this wax is used, is used for casting. Now the inlay wax, it has two types, type 1 soft, type 2 hard, it has various colors, blue, green, purple available in cake, sticks and block forms. It is used for making wax patterns of inlays, onlays, crowns and bridges. It has a composition that consists of paraffin wax 60%, carnauba wax 20%, cerosine wax 10%, bees wax 5% and gum damar 5%. This is the visual representation of inlay wax. As you can see we have inlay wax in the form of blocks, cakes and sticks. Now the casting wax. It is used for making Pattern for metallic framework of removal partial denture. It is used for making acrylic buildups, glass, and bars, etc. It is available in sheet form, ready made shape, bulk. It is available in blue, pink, and white colors. Look, this is how casting wax is available in ready made shapes and in sheets. I have explained the uses of boxing wax in previous video. Now the boxing wax it is a type of processing wax. It is available in sheets, stripes and in ropes, moldable at room temperature. Boxing wax is available in sheets, ropes and stripes form as you can see. I have also explained the uses of sticky wax in last video. Now the sticky wax is a type of processing wax too. It is adhesive and brittle in room temperature. It is available in yellow and orange color, usually in dark colors. It has a melting range between 60 to 65 degrees centigrade. It has a composition which consists of yellow beeswax 60%, raisin 17%, and gum damar 17%. We get a sticky wax in dark color sticks such as this. Now the utility wax it has uses that are the standard perforated tray used with hydrochlorides may easily be brought to a more desirable contour by this I mean by utility wax. This is done to prevent a sag and distortion of impression material. 
It may be used on the lingual portion of a bridge pontic to stabilize it while a labial plaster splint is poured. The utility wax is usually supplied in both stick and sheet form in dark red or orange color. It has composition that consists paraffin wax 16 per 60%, carnauba wax 25%, and sericin 10%. Utility wax is available in dark colored sheets and stick. Now I have summarized the classification and uses and all other things of all waxes in one slide. You can take a screenshot for memorization. Now thank you so much. If you like the video, please do subscribe and like.